Hola guys, how are you? Good day to my subscribers over here on YouTube, out there at Facebook, and also on TikTok. Guys, in this vlog or episode, I will be discussing on how I research on my cards and how I um, look for its prices, its current prices in the market today. Alright, but before that, I'd like to please invite you to Follow me on Instagram, that would be at timduncan21 underscore card collector. And also, please follow us, my Off-Centered family, which is my podcast group over at Off-Centered in Facebook. We usually held our podcasts every Friday nights at 9pm onwards, Philippine time. Alright, so let's discuss what are the sites that i use and how i do researches on on cards that i have or cards that i would want to uh, make research researches on all right so let's go So it's been a while guys that I have um, done another video. It's been a month or so. I mean, I've been kind of busy, medyo busy tayo for whatever reason it may be. But I have a lot of things in my plate. Um, surprise na lang sa mga followers ko and my subscribers ko ano yung mga yon in the, in the next, in the following months. Alright, so how do I make researches on certain cards? For example, I have this Kyrie Irving. Is in a Celtics uniform, <laughs> unfortunately, but I want to make a sample out of this. Alright, paano mo malalaman kung saan tong card na to kono set? By looking at the emblem here. But, para mas madali, you just have to flip the card over and look at that. That's Court Kings, Panini, um, it's 2017-18. Um, and also, Court Kings Basketball. So, madali lang. You just have to flip it over. So, paano mo malalaman kung anong klaseng kung anong nasa set na yon It's number 14 of that set. And it, there's also a um, parang, I don't know if it, could, it can be seen. It's portraits over here. So, it's a an insert of portraits number 14. And it's also number 25. So, paano mo malalaman kung magkano yon uh, but before that uh, paano mo malalaman kung ano yung mga kung anong sunset siya just to be uh, more accurate on it kasi minsan mali yung mga nakalagay dito rin eh magulo especially during the 90s all right sa back portion you have to do your research on these sites all right i'm going to share it with you ito mga to I just have to uh, get my ipad Kasi hindi ako masyado marunong gumamit ng computer na ila-live, ila right? So, dito malinaw naman. I'll show it to you. One site is called tcdb.com. Alright? Tradingcarddatabase.com You just have to type in dito, 2017-18. Um, Court Kings Basketball. So, drop down arrow here. Kita nyo yung baseball, gagawin nyo siyang basketball. And then, type in 2017-18 Court Kings. Okay, so may search bar. Ayan. Ayan na. So, 2017-18 Donras Court Kings daw. So, hindi yun yun. Number 18 siya, ayan sa baba. Number 18, 2017-18, Panini Court Kings. So, there you go. You just press it. Lalabas dyan yung data for it. Ty uh, dahil insert siya, alam kong insert siya, no? Type, uh, press inserts. Alright? Ayun, lumabas. So, you have to search on portraits. Lalabas yan. Portraits. Ayan ang portraits. There you go. Press it. And it's gonna be there. It's number um, 14. So, number 14 is Kyrie Irving. Ayan. Kyrie Irving. 
Um, the base set is serially numbered to 175. Itong inuuna ko to make research itong site na to. Kasi mas kumpleto dito, to be honest with you. And also Beckett.com. Alright? So, yan, no? So, i-back natin. Ano yung, ano to, anong klase itong number to 25? So, most probably, it's number 25. It should be a, um, I don't know, maybe a sapphire. Tingnan natin kung tama yung ano ko. Portrait sapphire. Yes, it's number to 25. Ayan. Number to 25. And number 14... Ayan yung Kyrie Irving, number 14 there. It's number 25. So, it's Panini Court Kings. Nakikita nyo sa taas. Ayan. 2017 Panini Court Kings. That's the set. And the insert is called Portraits. And uh, the parallel is a sapphire. Yun ang Panini. So, Beckett, ganun din. So, you can also use Beckett.com, which is this one. These are free sites, alright? Naku, uh, napindot ko yung ano. These are free sites. Ayan. Free sites lahat yan. This is Beckett.com. You just type in the the set and the name. Madali na yan. 2017, 18, Court Kings. Dito, mas mabilis. Kyrie Irving, lalagay mo na. So, misan inuuna ko, mas madalas actually talaga yung Beckett kasi mas, madali, mas madaling hanapin. But sometimes, wala rin doon. Misan wala sa TCDB. So, it's Beckett. These are free, ah. These are free sites kasi wala naman nakalagay na presyo. So, he, um, this is, these are free So you just have to look for the number to 25 Ayan, number to 25 Ayan siya It's Sapphire So okay So Kyrie Irving, Court Kings, Sapphire Alright, ganun lang kabilis maghanap ng ganitong cards no? You could also use Cardboard Connection Ang, ang problema lang with Cardboard Connection no? You just have to, have to type in the set there And look for it, no? Uh, for, look for the card. The problem with cardboard connection, yung mga 90s cards are not here. Actually, it's actually 2010 and below. Parang wala na rito sa cardboard connection. It's not yet, um, uh, idi, idi pa nalalagay. The, the data is not yet available here. So, I usually use, um, to make it simpler, no? I use um, TCDB and also um, Beckett.com for for uh, to look for data for for certain cards for cards that I want to look for uh, meron kasi mga cards na hindi mo alam kung ano set eh. so hahanapin mo you have to do re your research for it no now um, when it comes to pricing your cards usually we say comps no c o m p s that's called uh, that's short for computations um ang basis usually ng uh, ng comps is actually eBay um eBay prices so Badali lang yun. Pupunta ka lang ng eBay. It's also free. You don't need to register. You just type in the name, Kyrie Irving. Okay. Court uh, 2017. 18. Bear with me here. Uh, medyo mabagal tayo when it comes to... Um, um, typing on um, on the on these um, iPads or uh, tablets, and then put in portraits, no. Yan. So search. Ayon. Walang lumabas. <laughs> Ang nakalagay no exact matches found. So that means, kasi bihira naman talaga, uh, lalo na ngayon. It's Kyrie Irving actually lost in the didn't enter the playoffs, so. Um, walang masyado nagbebenta ng cards niya over the market. But, hindi na mo naman dapat tingnan yung um, um, yung presyo niya dito. Kung, for example, meron dyan, that it's not a, um, the completed listings. You have to put in, you have to, um, sorry, you have to do advanced research here. They're advanced. No, ta, punditin mo yun. And then, lalabas yung insert. There you go. Ang lalagay mo siya sa tick in completed items. Alright? So, and also sold items. There you go. That means, consummated yung deal. Okay? So, you put, you search on it, wala pa rin nahanap. So, okay, wala nahanap. So, that means, makikita mo dito um, yung mga ibang players of the same set. Like Damian Lillard finished at $9.50. Russell Westbrook 
finish at point forty nine because it's a sapphire, you have to type in sapphire. So, lalabas lahat siguro yung mga sapphire cards of the same set dito, no? So, pahanapin natin. Wala. Kyle Kuzma finished at $18.50. So, how do you estimate something like Kyrie Irving? Sino ba mas mata? Si Kyrie Irving o si Kyle Kuzma? It should be Kyrie Irving even though he is wearing a Celtics uniform here, no? But the thing is, yung, Kyrie, yung Kuzma na nakita natin is actually graded. $18.50. It's BGS 9.5. So, medyo mataas. It's a gem mint card of Kyle Kuzma of the same set. It's also sapphire. So, mas mababa to, most probably because it's not graded even though it's a Kyrie Irving over Kyle Kuzma. So, I would assume siguro about 10 to $12 itong card na to right now. Medyo mababa. Uh, well, I got this for what? What? 100 bucks before? So, it's not, it doesn't really matter to me. So, itong card na to is not for sale. Uh, it's part of my Kyrie Irving collection. I don't, have re I don't really have a Kyrie Irving PC, but, you know, I collect whatever I want. I collect sometimes. I just, you know, do you, alam mo yung mga langgam na just, um, they collect everything. They just put food on the table and stuff like that. That's how I collect, actually. I just collect on a whim sometimes. And, sa and sometimes I can't even sell those cards uh, for, for whatever reason it may be. I just have... A uh, hard time selling some of my stuff uh, that I got, but maybe in time. This is this is not my PC. Kyrie Irving is not my PC. So, ito meron siya dito number twenty five again, no? So, um, this could uh, end. This could be sold for about ten to twelve dollars in my opinion. So mas mababa siya. but it's uh, ang Lillard kasi natapos na nine dollars fifty, and it's number to sixty five. So I am assuming. A number to 25 Kyrie Irving would be more than this um, uh, Damian Lillard. So, siguro, uh, tops of uh, $15. All right. So, again, um, ang mga tinitingnan natin na mga sites are yun, no? But, there's also one site that you could look for when it comes to pricing your cards as well. But, wala naman. May sold listings din, but... Uh, Mostly ang tinitingnan dito yung mga Buy It Now listings. And also, you could actually also look at the names and the sets in this site. It is called check checkoutmycards.com. Yung mga nagka-cards, alam yan. C-O-M-C. Alright? So, um, tatype nyo lang dyan. Hahanapin nyo yung, kunyari, ito Kyrie Irving, no? Just put in Kyrie Irving portraits. Lahat ng Kyrie Irving na portraits, lalabas. So, even the, the older sets, lalabas dyan. So, Ayan, may lumabas sa portraits na isa of, o baka sa different year. It's a uh, 2013-14. It's being sold for $57.75. Walang bumibili. It's a blue frame number 273. But the thing is, again, it's not a sapphire. It's not number 25. So, and these cards, itong mga ganitong klaseng cards, are not sold items. But so, sometimes you can also, um, for for um, for common cards or base cards that are hindi naman sobrang mahal, you could actually base your items here. For example, usually one dollar, point seventy five, point ninety nine. Don mo makikita yon. At saka it's usually um, when you look at it, you could actually average it out here, no? Using by using the set. But when it comes to cards like uh, the rarer cards, it's hard to base your cards on the on these prices because usually, uh, mataas ang mga cards dito, mataas ang presyo nila. But you could actually look for cards here that are even obscure cards that you can't look for on you know, eBay and stuff like that. You don't mal makikita. So again, yun yung mga sites at meeting nang ko that I look for, uh, that I use to do data to look for data on certain cards that I have that I don't have that I want to do research on, and also for pricing the cards. Another um, site that I for uh, before I forget no is also Mavin, Mavin dot um, dot io. Okay. So, yung iba hindi alam yan. Ang, ang Mavin, it's a, um, it's a, uh, um, it's a, it's a site wherein uh, you could look for certain prices of certain cards that were sold on eBay. eBay din ang platform na, na ginagamit nito eh. Um, but, older cards, older sales, sales reports, no? Um, usually, eBay cuts off um, filters. Um, their um, computations or, or or data on on sales on their on 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 data on sales um, 
uh, ng, so I think, two months or three months, if I'm not mistaken, no? I think it's about three months. They will be uh, filtering that already. But with Mavin, kahit na yung mga ibang cards from um, years back, lumalabas dito. But, medyo, ano, medyo hindi ganun ka-accurate. But at least, no, itong mga to, lumalabas din. Like, for example, sige, type natin tong Kyrie Irving ito. I hope may lumabas. Sapphire. Okay. 2017-18 Portraits Alright, sana may lumabas Para makita ninyo magkano siya nabibenta Before Okay, wala lumabas Wala rin lumabas So, uh, tanggalin natin yung sapphire Let's see kung may lalabas Kung portraits lang ni Kyrie Irving Ayun, may lumabas Number 2, 175 It was sold 2 years ago Oops, sorry Oh, kasi may lumalabas na ads because it's it's also free $7.49 2 years ago ayun na kalagay 2 years ago so there you go lumalabas yung iba dyan Dayan, meron pa nga 4 years oh. 4 years ago number 2 20 ito blue parallel it's it's <laughs> kamali dito yung listing ayun blue parallel it was sold for $4.49 so medyo matagal na yung 4 years so it should have gone up already because of the, you know, the, the pandemic prices and stuff like, you know. Um, everything went up um, during that time. No? Ito nga, meron na benta rito four years ago then. It's $25, but it's number 25 of 25. It's in the eBay one of one. So, yung mga yan, no? So, nakikita mo dito sa Mavin, again, it's mavin.to. Okay, pakita ko ulit sa inyo yung site for those who wanna... Ito, ayaw nang bumalik. Sandali. Ayan. Uh, Alright. Ayan. Mavin.to. Alright? Ayan. Tinitingnan ko rin dyan. That's where I do my research on. That's where I base my cards on. Especially for older cards that I can't find computations for. Um, on eBay. Yung recent sales nila. So, tumitingin din ako sa Mavin. But, uh, you know, at least meron kang gauge. Meron kang uh, basis for your computations. Alright? Again, Again, isa-isahin natin ulit. I also, I use, uh, pakita ko na lang, papakita natin yan. Okay, hindi ko na lumalabas. Ayan, tcdb.com. Okay. And then, I use beckett.com. Ayan, beckett.com. The Cardboard Connection. Alright. Nasaan na ba yung isa? Ay, ito. COMC. Um, it's short for um, Check Out My Cards. Alright? And also, that's a platform where you also could actually consign your cards. You could actually have a um, an account there at COMC. And then, doon yung ibibenta yung mga cards ninyo. No? It's like a marketplace. Um, and also, you could actually buy there. It's a marketplace. Uh, technically, it's a marketplace for cards and also, I think, collectibles. If I'm not mistaken. Hindi lang cards, I think. So, COMC. But it's, check out my cards. So, it's cards. No? It, but not, hindi lang sports cards. And again, I use, of course, for computations, I use eBay. Advance, again, advance. You have to click advance. And then check the completed listings and also um, sold out, so sold items. It was sold, no? so para makita niyo yung kung magkano nag-end yung item. And also I also use Maven.io. Okay, so ayan yan yung mga ginagamit nating site to research on certain cards like this one. Again, ang titingnan sa sa cards pag nagahanap kayo kung ano set siya, kung saan siya galing is the back portion especially if it's panini and also the logos of course and just like this one nasa likod din naman yung lumang cards like this jordan although nasa harap and bay hoops it's also here at the back kaso ito medyo tricky kung titignan 1990 yan nakalagay so you have to look at the playing the, the year when, when when jordan stopped for example it's 1989-90 yung pinakahuli rito na nakasulat. So, this should be 1990 to 1991. <coughs> but to order, in order to check that, <coughs> pinakamaganda dyan, tingnan nyo sa mga sites sa binigay ko sa inyo kanina. <coughs> Alright? Sorry for that. Medyo inuubo-ubo rin ako. 
Um, it's been a while since I've uh, done videos. I hope you like the video that I did right now, this vlog that I did. For the newbies, for especially for the newbies who want to uh, do research on their cards, all right? For computations and the sets that you... <coughs> kung ano set siya, kung saan siya galing, <coughs> kung ano year siya galing, and everything like that. So, um, um, and if you have any questions, you could actually comment down below. Again, thank you very much for watching. And I hope I could do another video next week, even though I'm kind of... Uh, <coughs> medyo swamped ako nowadays it's been a, it's been a while so hopefully um, I could do one again for the for you to be able to, <coughs> to for me to be able to share my knowledge to you if you call this knowledge all right my card knowledge to you so thank you very much for watching I hope you like the video and please do subscribe to my channel and also watch my other videos it's now the playoffs I am hoping to be able to do some of the some of my takes uh, on um, who to collect and who to invest on during the, these playoffs. And feeling ko sana Manalo Phoenix. Ako gusto ko Manalo Phoenix because I want the Phoenix Suns to win a championship because the franchise haven't, uh, they haven't, the, the franchise hasn't won anything yet um, since their inception uh, in the NBA. So gusto ko Manalo Phoenix. Kawawa naman si CP3. <laughs> At saka si Kevin Durant, yung legacy niya, uh, sinasabi na um, nanalo, nanalo lang siya ng championship because he transferred to Golden State um, and joining the big three there which, you know, Draymond, Clay and Steph Curry. So, um, this could prove, um, this could be his um, 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 uh, uh, a point to... Uh, to say to people, to to um, prove to people that he actually belong in the top 75 players of all time. <laughs> so thank you very much again for watching and I hope to see you again soon. Thank you and God bless. Hindi namamatay, sandali.